Hello guys, uh, here is a video guide where I'm trying to explain uh, how to get rid of this uh, uh, vmxclient.exe problem which might happen in your computer after the system gets infected with malware or to be more technically uh, correct with uh, some rootkit. Uh, this particular uh, virus um, doesn't allow you to run uh, any uh, antivirus software. When you attempt to launch malware bytes uh, or some other uh, decent anti-malware program, uh, there will be a special pop-up that will tell you that requested resource is in use. And um, in this particular video guide, I am explaining how to get rid of this problem uh, using a software called Malwarebytes Anti-Rootkit uh, beta version. Uh, actually, uh, I have been able to download this uh, application uh, from this uh, resource. I'm going to show you where it is located. Um, you may go to Google Chrome and then to a uh, link called downloads malwarebytes.org uh, slash uh, slash uh, file and then slash mbar so slash file slash uh, mbar actually this will uh, download the program however the problem is not in downloading but the problem uh, the problem is in uh, actually um, executing this uh, application uh, what you need to do uh, is to uh, rename the installer of this uh, Malwarebytes anti-rootkit into uh, explorer.exe uh, so you need to rename this uh, anti-rootkit uh, executable from um, mbar uh, blah 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 into uh, explorer.exe and afterwards um, you need to uh, run this uh, application. According to my personal experience I was able to run it after uh, renaming it like I have explained to you. So you need to download it first using the link I have shown you. Uh, then you need to rename it. Then you need to rename this uh, application into uh, explorer.exe and uh, this will help you to finally um, launch uh, this uh, program called Malwarebytes Anti-Rootkit and which will ask, which is supposed to detect malware, uh, the rootkit causing this problem in your computer and to uh, delete it effectively. Uh, hopefully this will help you as well. If not, you might also try to uh, and the uh, task of this uh, win uh, VMX client malware in your computer. So uh, what you need to do uh, as another option to run Malwarebytes anti-rootkit is to go to task manager of your computer. Uh, there you will find this uh, win VMX client 32-bit process running, uh, you need to uh, right click on it and to end the, this process. You need to right click on it and to select end task and immediately, almost immediately you go to um, Malwarebytes enter rootkit renamed and start it. This is the solution how you may uh, at least try to start decent anti-malware service uh, for malware uh, detection. Hopefully this will help you. If not, get in touch to me uh, via my chat uh, in my site and you'll be able to get more help. Thank you for your attention. Goodbye.